Welcome to Ogalley Arts District, a tiny creative corner in a small conservative town. And scattered in between it all are some amazing murals. Most of the murals were painted by local artists. Some came here from out of state, some from out of the country. Each piece has a story and an incredible artist behind it. For the first mural of the series, I chose Guernica Deconstructed, painted on the side of a CrossFit gym by Matt Gondek in 2017. With its vibrant colors and familiar cartoon characters depicted in an unfamiliar way, this mural is hard to miss. It is so noticeable, in fact, that we almost lost it. Some people were offended by the piece and fought to have it removed. True creativity and self-expression won in the end. Hey guys, what's going on? This is Matt Gondek. I'm a pop deconstructive artist based out of Los Angeles, California. Uh, the mural in question I painted in December of 2017. It's my take on a very famous painting by Picasso called Guernica. My inspiration for this piece is just kind of my background. A lot of American TV and comic books and punk rock from the 90s. I kind of took what, I was, what I'm into and my background and applied it to this old painting. The mural fell under a lot of criticism and backlash in the town because there's just not a lot of murals there. Uh, and the ones that are there are a lot of wildlife, you know, animals and stuff. And a lot of people kind of viewed it as this big violent gang graffiti, which it wasn't. Uh, there was a lot of back and forth, had to go to court over it, but uh, the mural's still there. So hope you guys like it. Thanks. To learn more about Matt Gondek or buy his book, American Terror, go to mattgondek.com. So I love the mural. I think the style is awesome. Gondek's just an awesome artist. I, I can't believe we got somebody like that down here. Um, ever since we've had it, it, I just can't get over that, that it's on the outside of our business. So I'm just pumped about it. It, it became a whole political issue. They were saying that the, the whole mural was promoting violence in kids, which is kind of crazy because it's based off Guernica, which is Picasso's anti-war mural that he made, I believe it was over in Spain or possibly Portugal. Um, so many people just have been here and, and just wanted to be a part of it when it was happening and ever since it's been up. And stay tuned for episode two coming soon.